For several years, the hobby toy industry has been labeling radio-controlled toys as UAVs. They quickly learned they could sell a $500 toy for $50,000 simply by calling it a UAV with some fancy language. Many agencies have been fooled into believing that these hobby toys are commercial-grade professional tools. They're not. This is what the hobby toy industry will not tell you. The drone, a remote-controlled helicopter, crashed onto a sidewalk below, nearly hitting a man. Drone crashes into a crowd in Virginia over the weekend. But what about the military? They've been buying drones for a decade, right? Well, they've learned valuable lessons about hobby toys, too. <laughs> Olaris for domesticated UAS technology. The toy store is now closed. <laughs>